day 277 complete. Hey there, I'm the Path Walker. I upload daily videos about how my day went. I talk about the plan for the day and whether I did everything I planned on doing. I talk about the plan schedule for the next day. I have a bunch of different areas in my life that I'm working on and I try to track my progress in them. I try have goals that I'm trying to reach just reflect on my life, how I'm going one step at a time, learning, growing, trial and error. And I'm just sharing that with you guys and hopefully you guys can take something from that for your benefit. Okay, so improvement, but also a little bit unimprovement. What happened? Uh, well, for starters, better than yesterday, but the video could have been done earlier. It is 3.11 a.m. Last time I started this, it was 3.38 a.m., right? <laughs> so, a little, you know, we're, we're going earlier, earlier, earlier. Last night, we unfortunately, I did, you know, I mentioned it. I even said in the video, I was like, you know, I'm saying 4.30 a.m., but it's probably going to be 5 a.m. And if I say 5 a.m., it's probably going to be 5.30 a.m. because it's earlier than 6 a.m., which is what happened the night before. We ended up going to sleep at 5.40 a.m. Technically, it was a 20 minute improvement, but at, the, at, at least in my mind, and even right now, I'm thinking to myself, you know what, as long as I go to sleep and it keeps going, even if it's a little bit better, right, that's all that matters. And I really want that to be that message to resonate with you guys. Um, I feel like quickly in the self-improvement journey that we all have, in different areas, we can get very fixated on wanting more progress faster because we know it's possible, but really you're just being too hard on yourself is what I think. You need to really just say, hey, look, at the end of the day, you know, life is a marathon. And I know that's like a cliche or people say it, but like it doesn't matter if suddenly everything in one day, and I've said this in my last video, but it immediately you get this massive burst. Like imagine, like imagine you go months without being productive and suddenly you have a day where you spent 12 hours of hyper productivity because you're like, oh, well, I knew I could do it. Now I did it. Yeah, that's that, that, great. But then what about the next week and months from that point, right? steady progress i will take that a million times more than a short burst of crazy productivity or progress that then goes backwards it's like you know the the rabbit versus the turtle in a way you know you're gonna end up I mean, that's not the best comparison in a way but you get what i'm trying to say anyways um so what happened basically last night we went to sleep 5 40 a.m so not the best but still improvement from yesterday the issue was okay so we went to bed at 5 40 a.m i was planning on waking up at 1 p.m but the problem was the night before we only slept seven hours so i didn't get as ideal sleep and i needed more sleep so what ended up happening well we ended up waking up at like kind of like 2 p.m 3 p.m and i just was so tired and i ended up going to sleep and i woke up again around like 3 50 uh, p.m right before work so we didn't wake up on time but again, the going to sleep on time thing is the most important thing. We just finished grooming and having a shower. The things we didn't do. Okay, so I didn't do a workout, but honestly, I am so sore from the rock climbing I did the day before. Like my whole body was like, and my neck has like some soreness too because I was really pushing it that time. And like, there was no way I was doing anything with this soreness. I'm just, I know you can push and work out through soreness, but I was just like, you know what? Let's let it be. Um, you know, I plan on rock climbing tomorrow, so I don't want to give myself, I want, I want to feel fresh. I want my muscles and body to feel great for that when I go. We didn't walk the dog. This is one thing. It was rainy outside. I'm really not a fan of walking my dog when it's rainy or just walking in general when there's massive puddles of water everywhere, but I could have still done it at night, but I didn't. I didn't set up the rock climbing. <laughs> this is kind of a meme at this point because I keep wanting to do it, but it's like, I really need to have the thing in front of me and determine like what I need to do because I want to bolt it onto my uh, wall, but I think I need a piece of wood to actually properly do that. I need to figure out where the beams are in my wall to properly bolt. I need to find out the tools. 
but that's all something that takes time to prepare and look and figure it out. And I'm just, I, I, and I know it's a bigger task, so I'm not preparing for it, but it's okay. Vacuum the carpets I didn't do, not the biggest deal in the world. It's, it, it's a quick thing to be done. Abstinence, success, more temptation, but we managed to go away from it. Had some weird situation with my, one of my ex relationships that was messaging me and it was funky, but it's okay. So uh, I didn't do Twitch work, unfortunately. I kind of just chilled until like 2 a.m. after work. And then I started to do my grooming and showering and all that. And that took longer than I expected it to, but alas. I am going to eat quickly. I'm probably going to eat some lasagna, either that or I'm going to heat up a pizza. Not sure, but um, that's done. And here is the schedule. So we had a smoothie. We did have a salad. This was great. My mom actually made a salad, which is delicious. I love it. I actually love salads. Like with some croutons, delicious. It feels healthy. I love it. And that's that. So uh, the plan for tomorrow, we're going to wake up at 12.30 p.m., cold shower, have an egg meal, rock climbing, walk the dog when I get back, the usual, the usual stuff. Uh, we're gonna vacuum the carpet, and then, oh, this should be extended here, and then we are going to stream. We're gonna upload our video, of course, before streaming, but I would like to get my stream started as soon as possible. Um, and then we're going to go on church, uh, to go to church, uh, in the morning and we're not gonna have as much sleep. We're gonna have like six hours of sleep, but that's fine. I know I can manage it Okay, so that's that uh, for our goal of your exciting uh, sleep I'm still gonna keep it here because we woke up late. We didn't go to sleep at an earlier time, but it's okay Nutrition I'm going to improve because we have been consistently eating uh, uh, our middle meal breakfast and afterwards, which is great Fitness, I'll keep here. Everything else to keep here. Main job, um, I feel like, you know what? I'm going to give myself a yellow right now. I had a meeting with my manager. I feel good about things going forward and uh, performing well where I need to go. And we can finally start getting into that green territory. So I'm happy to move main job here. Uh, family, friends, romantic, we'll keep that all there. Grooming is basically a green like that. Dog walking, as much as I hate to do it, it's unfortunately going, I'm gonna. I'm not gonna put myself orange, I'll, I'll put it into a dark yellow. Uh, vacuuming, until I do the carpets, we need to put that there. And that's it, okay, so Not much to really say, um, other than you know what I what I mentioned earlier about you know the slow progress, focus, um, not relying on bursts of motivation, um, and really building, you know, foundational habits that will help you, and taking it kind of one step at a time, right? Don't overwhelm yourself with too many things you want to do at once. For me, the sleep is what I'm constantly focusing. Yes, there's other things too, but the sleep is the one that I am routinely telling myself to do. Um, so far, what did we do? We we went rock climbing on, did we go rock climbing on Tuesday? Forgot. Um, actually, I could check. Let me just make sure because I did. I went rock climbing on Thursday. No, I didn't, I didn't, I didn't. I went rock climbing on uh, Thursday. I'm going to go rock climbing tomorrow. And then I'm either gonna go rock climbing on Sunday and or Monday. So those will be our three days. If we go to church, you know, our weekly goals, it was the getting the sleep, uh, <laughs> going to church, which were the last weeks, and uh, going to rock climbing at least three times in the week. So all capable, all doable, and we're, we're moving towards that direction. And that's all I care about right now. There's nothing else that I'm adding on. And I'm, I'm trying to develop the habit in my mind so that this becomes easier and easier and easier until it gets completely ingrained and we just do that. And the other thing that I really think it's really big, and I mentioned this before, but I want to repeat it because it's such an important point. Whenever you are failing on something like you, for me, like let's say you ended up sleeping too late or try to identify what it is that caused the problem. What is it that caused you to not be able to do something you wanted to do? Find those things. It could apply to many areas and it could be anything, but identify what those things are and see what you can do 
to just get those out. Okay, okay, this is causing a problem here. What can I do about this? Maybe I need to change it or maybe I need to get rid of it altogether. I mentioned this before, but do you have a friend that is a bad influence for you? You might have to cut that off. As you know, it's if, if they are not, if, if while well, sure it's fun to do something with them, but you need to then question, but overall in the big picture of my life, do I like things or am I trying to improve and make things better overall? And you'll realize that it's not, you know, pros and cons, right? Figure out what's more important to you and make a firm decision at that point. Um, yeah, I feel, I feel great. I feel like, um, I'm moving quite in a good direction. And again, I really love the fact that I'm not really crazy amped up or motivated. I feel great and like in my daily life right now at a, um, it's not exaggerated, right? It's not that burst of motivation. I feel like I am just easy. My life overall is easing into a healthy state. And, you know, I can't help but also think that the abstinence could have a, an important part to play in this, you know, and I'm working out as well. Yeah, a, over a month ago, I planned on being a lot more firm with that goal, but I realized that sleep takes priority and then I could go with, the, OK, let's work out a lot more. Um, let's, you know, make, let's adapt the abstinence in certain ways but for now i'm really liking what's happening i don't feel like changing anything necessarily other than just focusing on the sleep and then once that's done then i can start working on other things as you see i, I did i improved my nutrition today i improved my job today on the on the color stuff so i'm you know improvement is what it's all about that's the name of the game why don't i even show let's see let's just see what it is right now it's from the start of the month look at that Look at that. Look at that beautiful gain that we've done this month. This to me is amazing. Amazing. Right? Um, so that's what that's what this channel is all about. But even if that was an amazing gain, it's all about time, right? I want to see I want we, we need to compare what where did we start from when we first started this series and where did we get to after a year? Those are the real changes, right? Because you can go up and down like crazy, but it's all about that consistent stability that you want to improve on. Man, my videos are getting a lot longer. I don't know if you guys like the longer or shorter, but keeping it to the point. But uh, I'll leave it. I'll leave you guys with that. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.